Hello everyone, this is the Drill Press, and what we're going to do right now is the Drill Press Safety Talk. These questions that I say will be on the answer, uh, <laughs> will be on the test, and they are the answers. The Drill Press itself is used to make holes. You're going to need to know the following things. The bit goes into the chuck by the use of the chuck key. You can open the chuck up by hand by twisting the collar, and when it is this bit's a little big, so I'm going to get a smaller one. And when it is the when it's open, you can stick the blade, the bit up in there, and then just simply repeat the process, turning that collar until those little jaws grab a hold. At which point, you insert the chuck key in, twist, and make sure you take it out, put it back. To turn the tool on and off, you push the green button. To turn, uh, to turn off, you push the red button. Green is on, red is off. <coughs> Excuse me. Please make sure that you're always using a piece of wood between the table and the object that you are drilling. You'll also want to use a clamp to hold your work in place, and you can adjust this little knob right here to make the clamp tighter or less firm. If you need to adjust the height of what you're drilling, you have two options. The first one is this. This is our drill stop adjustment. Just push that little button in, raise it and lower, and that will allow the drill to only go so far. And if you need to lower the table, it's a matter of loosening this lever over here and then raising and lowering it by turning this lever here. Please always make sure that you are thinking about the material that you are using and to minimize heat, you're adjusting the speed. Only adjust the speed once the tool is on. Otherwise, make sure that you're wearing protective goggles in here and that you're focusing only on your own work. Thank you.